afternoon folks, Big Bo here with another great Class C motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. Today, gonna look at one of my personal favorite Class C's. This is the Fleetwood Jamboree GT, model 31K. It's a 2006 model, folks. It's in great condition. Uh, reasons I, this is one of my favorites is I like a lot of outside storage in a Class C. And this is actually one of the few models that has basement storage like a Class A does. Really nice, clean RV, of course, Fleetwood Jamboree, the best-selling Class C of all time. Looking around it, folks, it's in great shape. I love the way these are built. Of course, Fleetwood RV, one of the pioneering members of the RV industry. You're talking about a brand that's been around for well over 60 years. And, of course, the Jamboree. You know, who, who doesn't, who's not familiar with Jamborees, folks, that's been around RVs? Got the cab over. I like the fact there's no windows in the front of it, so you don't have to worry about sealing it and, and, and leaking. Notice how it's uh, got the cap on the front instead of the straight edges. That's a sign of a well-built RV. See the one next to it that doesn't have the cap? That's the ones you got to keep sealing on to keep from leaking. This right here is going to be a lot more leak resistant than a uh, than one without it. Got the running boards, got a 4KW Onan generator running right now, powering everything up inside. This unit's only got 76,000 miles, folks, which, considering the type of motorhome it is, not bad. In fact, the NADA, even though I don't go by it, actually gives a $3,100 uh, uh, increase to the value because they consider it low miles. You can take that however you want to, folks. 4KW Onan. Uh, Firestone tires, it's got the optional Alcoa wheels. You know, most Class C's have wheel covers, like this one right here. Uh, this has got the actual alloy wheels. Got the slide-out trays that come out with the room so that you can get to your storage base without hitting your head on the slide-out while it's out. Corner's not beat up. Look how good this finish and striping looks for an 06 model. But remember, folks, it's a nice unit, but it's still 13 years old, so... And you can see the corners aren't beat up. Got a 5,000 pound towing capacity on the back. Perfect for a runabout. No delamination. Even the corners have got the caps on it. When you've been around and built as many jamborees as Fleetwood has, you learn a thing or two and you use that research to your advantage and you make a superior product. In fact, in my personal opinion, Fleetwood and Winnebago's are the two best brands you can buy in a Class C motorhome. And I'm sure people argue with me about that. Now, they're two of the more expensive brands. I just looked these things up online in a 2019's in a, in a Jamboree this size. They're bringing $100,000, but you get what you paid for. And that is an RV that even after 13 years and 76,000 miles still looks and runs this good. Got the power steps, let's look inside. And we're actually about to get a storm out here, so really, really good timing. All right, folks, as we step inside, it's nice and cool in here. I've got the ducted air on. The dash air is cold, got 76,000 miles, backup camera works great, power windows, power locks, tilt crews, leather captain's chairs. You can tell this was a higher end Class C motorhome. Got a queen bed in the cab over and you can look in the cab over folks in the corners. I've got pictures of it too. No stains up here, no water damage, nothing underneath the windows. You always want to look underneath the windows when you're in a cab over of a Class C motorhome, especially if there's a window in the front. Uh, place for a TV right here. Uh, we can certainly add one for you. Just let your salesperson know he'll get you a price. You know, these are great family motorhomes, folks, because you can sleep eight people in here in four separate beds. So perfect for the family, perfect to take the kids to the lake uh, for the weekend or the beach or something like that. I mean, it's, it's a decent little motorhome, folks. You got a three burner stove top, gas oven, and electric halftime oven. This is a microwave and electric oven. 
So you've got two ovens in here, and that's rare on a Class C. Eight cubic foot and Dometic RV refrigerator freezer. Right here is all your uh, controls, generator, uh, 554 hours, which is good for the year model. All your tank monitor levels are right here, slide out controls. Everything's right here, folks, easy to get to. You don't have to go around from one side of the RV to the other to set everything up. Sleeper sofa makes a bed, table booth makes a bed, and um, plus your queen bed in the back. And it's got this particular, the 31K floor plan, is uh, one of the largest bedroom and bathroom areas you can get in any Class C motorhome. I mean, this thing's huge, folks. I mean, you can have a dance in here if you want to. Queen Island beds, you've got a big closet over there, a mini closet over there. Um, again, folks, day-night shades. You can look under the windows. There's no stains or wrinkled spots. Been a well-cared-for motorhome right here, folks. Walk-through bathroom, huge walk-through bathroom. Got a glassed-in shower with a skylight. I like this, uh, and you can see, I don't know if this has been added or not because the stickers look perfect in here just about. So I don't know if this is the original shower or somebody added it to it, but it looks great. And you can look around the skylight, folks. No, you see any water stains, any marks, anything like that. Huh. So it looks great. Vanity area right here, medicine cabinet. Got a private water closet with your toilet. And, and look at this, folks. How many Class C's do you normally see with two vanities? And two ba or two bathroom sinks? It's got it. Toilet. And again, folks, you can look around the vents. No water stains. No soft spots or wrinkles or anything like that. I mean, this is a well cared for class C motorhome folks. It really is and got a lot of life left to it. Nightstand, um, got a little countertop extender right here that you can pop up if you want to. Hmm. His and her sinks, which is, I reckon this is about the first class C I've seen with two bathroom sinks. It's a nice little uh, Class C motorhome, folks. And the good thing about the size, it's like 32, a little over 32 feet long, is that you can still get this in most of your RV parks, especially your your uh, older ones like your state parks and your older campgrounds that can't accommodate bigger coaches. This is an easy size to get in them. Got one slide. Roomy in here. Look at that headliner. It's perfect. No stains anywhere, nothing hanging down, no watermarks, no soft spots anywhere. Original carpet looks great. Upholstery looks great. You're going to be impressed with this Jamboree GT, folks. And you'll love that basement storage, of course. Now, you've got a little bit higher up floor than most Class C's. So you've got a couple of extra steps when you walk in. And you can see the step down in the, in the uh, cab to show you how higher up the floor is to accommodate that extra storage, but that extra storage, folks, in a Class C is is, is awesome. Anyway, folks, $34,900, you're going to get this motorhome. It will be checked out after purchase by our certified RV techs. In other words, after you purchase this RV, it's going to go in line to get checked out. Right now, we're looking about a week, week and a half for a Class C, um, and that's an estimate. And... Um, during that time, my RV techs are going to, this one's going to work its way to the front of the line. It's going to get checked out. We're going to go through it. We're going to make sure everything on our extensive RV component checkout list works perfectly. And if you want a copy of that list, contact my non-commissioned sales department team members. They'll be happy to email you or fax you over a copy of it, of everything that we inspect after we sell it. And they'll go over it with you, answer any questions you have, etc. That's included 349. After this unit's been through service, after my cleanup crew has cleaned it inside and out, my Gordy, my service manager, was going to go through this is going to go through this motorhome with uh, and make sure it meets his requirements for conditioning and how clean it is. 
and then he's and if he's happy with everything everything's good we're going to lock it up keep everybody out of it keep anybody from cracking it up or tearing it up we're going to call you right away set up an appointment for you to get your walkthrough demonstration and once you arrive at that appointed time the rv tech that checked it out that knows it better than anybody is going to go through this motorhome with you answer any questions you have show you how to operate everything show you everything works on our list answer any questions you have about as far as what he had to do for repairs if any and be honest with you folks if there's any repairs this coach needs they're going to be very very minor at least i believe so and of course help you hook up your runabout if you've got one we do sell towed always if you need one at very affordable prices um and much more uh, you're also going to get a 90-day nationwide limited warranty that goes into effect the day you pick it up or the day we deliver it. And you also get a drive-out tag. You get a starter kit with all your camping essentials like sewer hose, water hose, chemicals, adapters, toilet paper, etc. And you get 21 nights of free camping up to 7 nights at a time at select RV resorts nationwide. Uh, great campgrounds. I stayed there myself. That's a thousand dollars of free camping folks easy a thousand dollars That's included all of this 34 9 out the door plus applicable sales tax If you've got a question how much your sales tax will be and when and where you have to pay it Whether it's to us or to your local county DMV office Contact the sales department tell them where you live how you paying for it and they will get you that information that's all included, 349, no extra fees, no dock fees, no prep fees, no setup fees, no freight fees, none of that nonsense. Folks, all these dealers that add thousands of dollars of extra fees to the sales price after you make your deal are ripping you off because all those fees, 100% unnecessary, even on a brand new RV. Only thing you're required to pay is the sales tax and the sales price. That's it. And sales tax laws are complicated, folks. They vary from state to state. They're not universal. Please contact my sales department so they can tell you how much you would have to pay us for this camper or for this motor home so there's no surprises for anyone. And while you got them on the phone, they can also tell you the current lead time for a Class C checkout because that changes day to day. And they can send you over a copy of our checkout list for you to inspect as well. And, folks, this price of $34.9 includes all of those features, all of those amenities out the door, and it's a haggle-free firm price. We don't negotiate prices, folks. Yeah, we could. We could. If you want to negotiate, we'll mark it up $10,000. We'll say $44.9, and we'll start haggling. Or we can just cut out all that crap, put you right on the money, what it takes to buy it, $34.9 plus applicable sales tax if you want all those amenities that we include the free camping the nationwide limited warranty the inspection the walkthrough demonstration and more uh, we do offer an option b and option b is understand the conditions of option b sale folks is you buy the unit just like you see at the video as is where it is no inspection no cleanup no walkthrough demonstration no warranty no free camping all you get is the motor home a um you get a drive-out tag, a starter kit, your keys, and uh, we'll throw in an instructional DVD. That's it. And understand if you buy something as is, that means you, the buyer, are 100% responsible for any repairs this RV needs now and in the future. So, and there's no excluded systems to that. A lot of people seem to think motor and transmissions are excluded, but it's not anything and i mean anything on this rv tears up if you want to fix it you got to pay for it that's option b that's what as is means uh we don't know what works and what doesn't besides what i've checked out here in the video which is the generator the roof air and the fridge is starting to get cool and the lights and there's one or two bulbs burn out but like i said as is means you you know you take the good with any potential bad um, if you got a question about option B or option A, what they cover, what it don't covers, you know, or if you need clarification on as is, give our sales department a call. They'll be glad to help you. 706-965-7929 is our phone number. It's answered 24-7. If it's after hours, our answering service picks it up. If they can't help you, they will uh, get your contact information forwarded by sales department. They'll call you back the next business day. 
You can go to my website, which if you're on YouTube, folks, I'll have the link to the website in the video description below. Just click on that. You can look at my Class C's. You can look at this one. Uh, some benefits I'll have over YouTube videos, I'll have pictures, I'll have specs. I've got the factory brochure in here, and I'll have that on the website in PDF so you can look at it, answer any questions you have. Uh, also, I've got another advantage. I've got a 24-7 chat feature on our website you can take advantage of and a text feature you can take advantage of as well from the home page of the website. So you can apply for financing from the website. You can get your trade in appraised from the website. Folks, it's very interactive, very easy to operate. Strongly encourage you, if you're on YouTube, to either go to parkwayrvcenter.com or click on the link in the video description. Uh, nationwide delivery is available. Financing is available with approved credit. Minimum 10% mandatory down payment does apply to everyone, and that's either cash or trade equity. Uh, we do take trade-ins. We'll take other RVs, of course, cars, trucks. We'll take uh, classic cars. We'll tra take lawnmowers, tractors, folks, uh, pontoon boats, boats. Uh, you know, we won't take cruiser motorcycles, but we'll take dual sports dirt bikes, side-by-sides, golf carts, things like that as well. If we can get a value on it and we can legally sell it and not have to feed it every day, then we'll be happy to trade for it. So if you got something different, other dealers said no, you may be surprised when, I, when we say yes. And if you don't believe me, go back through my videos, folks, and look at some of the trade-ins that we've taken in over the years. I mean, everything from decommissioned police SWAT vans to news vans to concession trailers and, and much much more plus a ton of classic cars as well uh, give us a call 706-965-7929 now folks my personal recommendation and i say this in all my videos because if you don't do this it's off my conscience i can honestly tell you the truth you know i don't sugarcoat anything i don't hide anything if i see something wrong with an rv while i'm going through it I'm going to show it to you, and anybody that's watched any of my videos knows this. That's what makes me different from everybody else. You know, hey, the day that we have to lie to sell something is the day we'll just go out of business and close up because it's not worth it. All right, folks, I'm very bluntly honest. Keep in mind, this is a 2006 um, model, or excuse me. It's a, let me go ahead and clarify something real quick, folks. It is a 2006 model. I forgot to mention this earlier. It is built on a 2005 chassis like all Class C's are. And sometime over the past 13 years, the pre one of the previous owners titled this thing under the chassis VIN number instead of the motorhome VIN number. So the title is going to say 054 chassis. This is an 06, and I'll show you how I know because it says 05, so I have to legally sell it by what the year model listed on the title is. But... When you look in this closet right here, you'll see the factory build sticker. What's that year model say? 2006. It was sold new as a 2006. It was paid for as a 2006. But, like I said, over the past 13 years, somebody has mistakenly titled it as a 2005. Didn't catch it. State printed the title. And send it back as an 05 Ford cutaway chassis or a 2005 Ford 450 chassis or some version of that. Now that's something you may or may not be able to get corrected at your local DMV tag office. Uh, every state's different. Be honest with you, we just sell it by what's on the title. That way we don't have to go through the time and trouble because the difference between 05 and 06 is pretty... Uh, pretty minuscule but it is an 06 so new is an 06 but we're selling it as an 05 uh, because that's what the title says so um, most banks have seen this before it's a very common occurrence for those of you who watch my videos you know this happens a lot on especially on class C motorhomes so if you got questions about that give us a call of course um, this is a very very common thing all RVs are built on year old chassis the, the Fleetwood in this case buys the Ford chassis a weeks before they put it in their storehouse and they build the motorhome, the current year motorhome on those chassis. So this is something that's uh, very, very common. It's been a problem in the RV industry for, for decades and unfortunately the that's even with the brand new ones that's still an issue. 
you buy a brand new 19 model Jamboree, it's built on a 2018 model chassis. That's just the way they're built and the way they buy them. Anyway, folks, 2005, 2006 model, we'll say. Uh, 34.9, we'll trade, haggle free, or contact us for a, a haggle free price on option B. Or, for those, if you click over to my website, you can click on my get lowest price on our website, parkwayrbcenter.com, for this particular model, and I'll have the option B price listed under the get lowest price. But that is the option B price. Option A is the only way you get all those features like the warranty, the inspection, uh, the demonstration, the free camping, and all that stuff only comes with option A. In fact, if you take option B, I can't even sell you a warranty with option B because the warranty company requires us to do our inspection. So if we do the inspection, do the warranty, it's option A. Anyway, folks, if you got any questions about it, give us a call. Uh, 706 965 7929. We've been in business for 1968. That's 50 years. Third generation, family owned and operated. We don't have any extra fees. We don't use commission salespeople. We don't haggle. We did away with everything that everybody hates about buying a used vehicle, and, and our customers love us for it. We sell five to six hundred RVs, and you'd be surprised when we started doing that. Of course, we've never charged a fee, but when we stopped using commission salespeople, our prices dropped. When we start, stopped haggling, our customers increased. Because nobody likes haggling, nobody likes commission salespeople, we did away with it. Nobody likes all these surprise fees that have popped up in the last few years at other RV dealerships. You don't have to worry about that here, folks. Now, if you want to go back to the old way of haggling, the price is $44.9, we'll start haggling. But like I said, if you want the money, what it is to buy it, it's thirty-four nine. Nationwide delivery is available. Contact us for a quote. Uh, if you have any questions, call us, email us, sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Strongly recommend everybody clicks over to my website and view our current inventory. We've got tons of used RVs, about 140 in total. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Uh, I'm trying to mix up the RVs a little bit, trying not to do the same type of RV two times in a row. Um, I did a Class A diesel earlier. I'm doing this Class C. I might do a fifth wheel next um, just to just kind of break up everything. So I'm, I'm, I'm advertising something for everyone. I've got travel trailers, fifth wheels, toy haulers. I've got Class A's, B's, and C's. I've got some conversion vans coming in. Um, in fact, I'm going to be listing my, one of my own personal vehicles here in the next day or two. So make sure you subscribe. Stay tuned for that. Um, if you got any questions, give us a call. 706-965-7929. Evenings and Sundays, that number's answered as well. Um, you can go to my website. You can email us. You can chat with us. You can text us. You can go to, we're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You, you know, if you can't get in touch with us, folks... Of course, the best way is pick up the phone and call or visit us in person. It's not our fault. <laughs> uh, you just didn't try. Anyway, folks, as always, please call ahead to make sure this unit's available before driving any significant distance. I've had a lot of problems with this lately. Uh, you know, I never delete my YouTube videos. I've got 2,400 some odd videos going back to 2010. Obviously, 99% of those are, are long gone, but I keep them on there to help our Google search rankings. And uh, since Google owns YouTube. So keep in mind, most of them are sold. Check the date on the first of the video. Today is September 12, 2018. Uh, always call ahead to make sure it's available. You know, I tell people this all the time, but all it takes is a five minute phone call and a credit card is off the market. And thanks to the internet, our sphere of influence to sell RVs has grown substantially. I mean, I'm talking about people from all over the country travel down here to Ringgold, Georgia to buy from us because of our prices and how nice our RVs are. And you can thank our 50 years of connections and influence on how we get our RVs. We've got connections that other dealers could always dream of to get RVs. Anyway, folks, give us a call. Uh, drop us an email, come visit us, call before coming, make sure it's available. Uh, as always, folks, and I always say this because there's so much truth to this statement. Uh, I believe there is. Uh, here's, here's, here's the thing. You know, I understand this is a used vehicle. It's 
13 or 14 years old, depending on how you look at it. And it's not perfect. No such thing as a light new used RV. And I cannot stress this enough. I do not recommend or believe in buying vehicles, sight and so used vehicles anyway. New you can get away with, but used vehicles over the internet, I do not recommend it. Uh, sight unseen. Now I know a couple of hundred of you a year trust us enough to buy from a sight unseen. You don't know what you bought. You pay for it. You have it delivered to your driveway. You pay somebody to deliver it. You don't know what you got till it pulls up your driveway. I understand that, and I and I and I appreciate the res that y'all trust us enough to buy from us like that. I prefer to meet who I do business with, either as a buyer or a seller. And I like to look at what I'm buying before I pay for it. So I highly recommend all of you do the same thing. I know it's inconvenient, but you can drive here, you can fly here to Chattanooga, Tennessee for a few hundred bucks from virtually anywhere in the country. We'll pick you up for free at the Chattanooga, Tennessee airport during business hours. Come out, folks. Look at this RV. Let us know you're coming. We'll crank it up, crank the generator up, turn the air in the fridge on, let you spend some time in it, get to know it a little bit, do your own inspection, test drive it, and then decide if this is the RV for you. And then you can also, after that, decide if you want to do option A or B. And um, because, folks, one thing I've learned 22 years in this business, everybody's got different opinions about everything, including what kind of condition a 2005-2006 model Jamboree GT should be in to be considered nice enough for them to purchase it. I think this thing's a solid 9 or better out of 10 you may look at it and decide it's a 10 out of 10 or a 5 out of 10. And nobody's right, nobody's wrong. It's all opinion. Everybody's got one. So come out here, look at it, form your own opinion. That way there's no regrets, no buyer's remorse, none of that nonsense. Thank you again for watching. Come out and visit us. And uh, look forward to seeing everybody here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.